Hey, and today we have another talented Bahamian by the name of Monique Bastian from Monique's Creation. Hi, how are you? Welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. I'm great. Okay. Um, Monique, what inspired you to start baking these beautiful cakes? Well, actually, I was a cook for quite some time mm -hmm. and I, I was wanted to get into something different. Right. And the kitchen that I work in, um, we have a pastry chef, Chef Kim, while mm -hmm. we need to work, you know, he always showcasing his talent. Right. And it got me interested in doing pastry. Mm -hmm. And they had a position open and I applied and I got it and that's how I started. That's how you started. Yes. Okay. How long have you been baking cakes? I've been baking cakes for three years working, but I just started recently doing it for myself, like okay. birthday cakes, anniversary, weddings, whatever. Different Wonderful. Cakes, and yes. the designs that you do. Um, how do you come up with such creative designs? Do you have some sort of artistic abilities or you went to school to learn how to bake them or it just came natural? It just came natural. I never went to school. I never had no formal training like that. I just did it. And wonderful, it. wonderful. Yes. So that means you have a gift that yes. you did not know you had yes, until did. it was brought out when you were transferred to the pastry area. Yes. Okay, so do you only do birthday cakes? Do you do wedding cakes? You know, some wedding cakes have three layers, four or five. Do you do that also? Well, actually, I just, um, I really do just do birthday cakes, but um, so many people love my cakes. They are like asking me to do their wedding cakes and wow. everything. So now I'm getting into the wedding cakes. Nothing too big as yet. Right. But yeah, just sad enough, but probably two, three layers. And okay. I'm getting into the wedding. I'm so sure now. you're going to be awesome at that you <laughs> know you. and i'm a customer also okay. i met you like a month ago yeah, and so i've already ordered about four or five dozens of her delicious red velvet cupcakes she's addictive yes, yes it's very addictive <laughs> it is most things that people ask me to do i can do it and like i say i don't have any training but i just they just show me the picture and and that's it yes when i make a design mm -hmm. and you know usually when i post it you'll have people be like oh can i have this cake or whatever right and usually i have this thing if i make a, a new cake and if i have like a lot of people asking about the cake and mm -hmm. they want to um, get the cake what i usually do is the first person that buys the cake mm -hmm. i name the cake after them oh wow so yes i have a uh, rose of sharon mm -hmm. like this one here i named this after my boss mm -hmm. the minute i made this i had tons of people asking for it Ooh. and then i have the um, malik chocolate supreme wow that one took over the rose of sharon that one now is like my number one seller so can you make something with k like k special yeah okay like a, we I work on that something for you yes <laughs> Okay. Maybe something with red velvet because yes. you have my red velvet. Yes, so, yes. So yes. I can come up with something for you. Perfect. You're welcome. And Monique, um, how can our viewers contact you? Um, they can reach me at 815-6965 or on my Facebook page. That's Monique's Creation on Facebook. What's the average cost of a cake like this, this size? Okay. Well, a size like this, is, it ranges from $35 and goes up. It all depends wow. on um, what the customer wants. Right. But something like this would be like 35 that's very reasonable. Very reasonable. Yes, and this is what type of cake is this? This one here is um red velvet with a pound cake. My yes, favorite. Okay, favorite. red velvet. <laughs> red okay. velvet pound, and it has the rocher chocolates and with strawberries, kiwis, and pineapple. Then I have it um with my special whipped cream. Wow. And I have a design with the um a light brown and pink mm -hmm. with strawberries and fruits. Okay, Monique, let's let's dig into this. Um, everything on your cakes are edible, right? Yes, I also do the um, images also. Okay, so if you want images, photos, photos and all that. And yes, you just send it to my phone and I can just take it off. Okay. And just put it right onto your cake for you. Sounds awesome. Yeah. Looks very moist. I can yeah. see this is <laughs> gonna be delicious. I need, a, I need this? Yeah. Perfect. Everything together. There you go. There you go. It's so moist. Awesome. Great. Thank you. Fantastic. <laughs> what else Thank can I so say? Much. As usual? As usual. Just, yes. yes it is. Never a mistake. Never a mistake with Monique. I must say, um, from the time that I was baking over the last year, I have like, I can say like 98% of my customers are very pleased. And if the ones that are not pleased, I always, I never like to have a dissatisfied customer. Right. I always let them know, well, okay, I can make the cake over for you. And every time I, if I make it over, they are pleased and they have that wonderful that um experience like you have so yes you know sometimes things do go wrong but i make sure i correct that so right all of my customers are always please well thank you monique so much for the delicious as usual as usual red velvet and vanilla cake thank you bahamian tv monique bastian thank you so much now would you like to give any closing remarks yes i would just like to say um thank you to my chef chef kim 
because if it wasn't for him and him showing me what to do, I wouldn't be here today. Correct. And my customers, I just want to say thank you so much for supporting me over the year. And I look forward to doing business with you in the future. Awesome. And also, I want to thank you for inviting me here. That's not a problem. So thank you so much. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> for Heyman TV, keep watching. Okay. Hello everybody, I'm Patrice Francis, and here at Bahamian TV, we've made a commitment to you. We want to bring you a show that is by Bahamians, for Bahamians, about Bahamians. As far as we're concerned, you can't get more Bahamian than that. I'm excited because today we're at Down to Earth Adventure Farm on Cowpen Road, right in the capital, New Providence. I'm excited because sometimes we can get so caught up in the hustle and bustle of city life, we forget these oases that remind us of how sweet nature is. So today, we're going on a tour on a real Bahamian farm, and you're invited. So sit back, relax, but come along. Bahamian TV. <laughs> We have our peacocks. Now, as you can see in there, you see that blue bird with all those pretty colors and all those pretty um, design on its feathers? Yeah. That's the daddy bird. So that's the daddy bird with all the colors, okay? What sound does the turkey make? <laughs> see, he said it. Okay. Remember those little creatures in the G4 movie? That is called a guinea pig. So we have lots of animals to see today. Okay. All right. So what is this called? It's called a rabbit. Okay. and we collect the eggs. So in here we have chicken, duck, peacock, geese, and the quail eggs as you saw. <laughs> then we have a white crested duck, which will be that same duck with the white crest in the front hair. That's called a white crested duck. <laughs> Boys and girls, this is called a papaya tree. Okay? You can boil the leaves and this helps you build up your resistance to get rid of the flu. The papaya tree happens to have a male and a female tree. Now, that is why when you're going to plant the seed, you'll plant at least three or four seeds in a hole. If you look over here, you'll see this papaya tree that has all those flowers on it, okay? Now, that's a male papaya tree, okay? Now, the bee will go there and take the pollen from the male tree, bring it to the female, and then the female will then have fruit. The male tree won't ever have fruit. So you know the difference between a papaya tree with the male having all those flowers and the female won't have those types of flowers. Now the tree behind you is a guava tree. Who likes guava dog? Me! All right. So that will have guava and guava is what you'll use the fruit to be able to make the guava dog.
Okay, so we're going to throw it in just a small piece. I'm giving them breakfast now. Yes. <laughs> That's right. At Games and Things, Games and More and Sell All, we have the largest selection of flat screen televisions in the entire Bahamas. Now, we are proud to introduce our mega special on our 4K flat screen smart televisions. Listen up, 43 inch 4K smart LED televisions, only $4.99. 50 inch 4K smart LED televisions, $5.99. 55 inch 4K LED smart televisions, $6.99. And our 65 inch 4K smart LED television going for a low, low price of only $1,399. Oh, before I forget, come in and take advantage of our 20% off on all of our small appliances. So come on down and take advantage of our huge savings. Games and Things, Marathon Road, opposite First Caribbean Bank, telephone 394-4705. Games and more, so West Plaza, Michael Road, telephone 361-7265, sell all in the Marshalls Plaza, Michael Road, opposite Kazamaki Church, telephone 361-7267. When I say that I'm having one of the wealthiest experiences of my life at Down to Earth Adventure Farm, I'm not kidding. I mean, Karen and I are sitting here. We've got a papaya tree in the background, green guavas on the tree. We've got banana tree. We have the coconut tree. I'm telling you, this is the Bahamas. Karen, you're the event coordinator here at Down to Earth Adventure Farm. You do the tours. Uh, talk to me about what you have to offer the Bahamian public first of all. I mean, the tourists can come, but this is something for us, and then we, we're happy to share it with other people as well. First of all, I'd like to say thank you for coming to Down to Earth Adventure Farm, and we do appreciate you taking time out of your schedule to come here. But this is such an awesome project. 
and an awesome property that we try to encourage all Bahamians just to come and have a little taste of it because they get caught up in all the stresses of life and when you come here it's like you're on another island and you don't have to leave Nassau to go to this particular island but it's just so so much serenity peace of mind you want to get away from all the stress this is where you come I'm telling you and it's amazing I was talking to Mr. Sinclair you know and he was saying that his goal is really to have 700 islands represented here so we've got uh, the the uh, the pigs are from Long Island. The, the turtles are from Cat Island. We got some goats from Abaco. He, he's got some pineapples from Eleuthera. And it just keeps growing and growing. That is so correct. And, you know, that was one of our, our goals to be able to encompass the entire Bahamas here by bringing a little bit from all the different islands and have them right here so that when the the Bahamian people come and also the tourists when they come to visit they can taste a little bit of Cat Island, Exuma, Eleuthera and what have you and then right behind me we have the conch stand and so that's all the conch. Everything happening with conch is going to happen right there in that booth. Then you got a daiquiri booth. We have a daiquiri booth that is correct and then we also have a pizza palace where we make our own pizzas here right at the farm. You all know how trees go. I didn't have that pizza. I mean they picked the vegetables, put it on the pizza gene and I had lunch and it was so nice and fresh. Yeah, and all the herbs, we actually grow all the cilantro, the parsley, the onions, the sweet pepper, the kale, all those different things that we can have on our pizza. Right, we're right here at the farm. I'm here with Mr. Sidney Sinclair, who is the founder of Down to Earth Adventure Farm. Listen, people like you make me so proud to be Bahamian. You, you're an Andrus man in, in a way. I mean, you grew up in Nassau, but tell me what you used to do down in Andrus, you know, for, for the summers as a child. Well, during, during the time when we were young, uh, Mum would send us to Andrews every summer to spend time with our grand aunt. And when our grand aunt get a hand on us, she teaches us how to set in the boat, she teaches us how to scull, she takes us for crabs, she shows us how to fish, she teaches us how to wash on the scrubbing board, she teaches us how to bake in the rock oven, and all those different things. And we couldn't really wait until the summer just to be able to spend that two months going up by the mail boat. You know what I mean? Yes, and yes. those were good times. Yeah, so you had a vision, Mr. Sinclair. I mean, I grow up here and my, my mommy and my Grammy, they're talking about all the Lowy, they're talking about Dutch oven and and, 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 and rock oven. You, you had a vision to actually make this a reality on this farm. I felt in my life it was missing because as small boys, when we were growing up, we always had pigeons and chickens and, and goats and sheep and all that. Yeah. And when you look around, it was missing and then we have all the new generation coming up. Right. So I figured it was a job for me to actually put those things in place mm -hmm. so our little kids will be able to experience those things for his hand. You can make your cold slow out today. Thank you, man. Thank you. Look here. Off the tree, folks. <laughs> Off the tree. <laughs> Put up. Hey. Yeah, man. Look at that. Shop grade. Look at that. Look at that, right? I mean, the corn in the bottom. Straight on the farm, right, right on your table. Yeah. Couldn't get it no better than that one. I'm serious. I, I really feel like I've spent the day in paradise. And I have, because we're in the Bahamas and we're a down to earth adventure farm. Thank you so much, Karen. Thank you, too. And thank you for having us. We'll see you when you come back down here. Bahamian TV. <laughs> This is amazing. It's amazing. Yeah. Step Up Fashion providing you with your most stylish shoes and accessories for very low prices. Catch their sale on sandals as low as $10. You can find them on Facebook at Step Up Fashion 242, Instagram at Step Up underscore Fashion. You can also call, text, or WhatsApp at 466-1395 for further inquiries and deliveries. Free delivery service available. Don't miss out. Step Up Fashion, your latest fashion needs. We have one small onion, one stalk of celery, one teaspoon of thyme and black pepper, and we have one tablespoon and a half of tomato paste, five snappers, one cup of flour and five cups of water. I'm Kay and I'm Ray and today we will be cooking with Anthea Newbol, a 12th grade student from St. Augustine's College who is aspiring to become an executive chef. Yes and we all know on Bahamian TV we promote Bahamian talent and we're excited today to be cooking with Anthea and we'll be cooking stewed fish and we'll top it off with some Mammy's Johnny Cake Mix. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. 
So today, the first thing we're gonna start with is frying the fish. Now we have this hot oil here. Get this. And just rest the fish in there. Careful, it's going. Yeah. Just gonna cover it while it fries. Yes. Okay, so tell me, and Kira, when did you discover your talent for cooking? Um, I discovered my talent at a very young age. You know, you heard the stories of your grandmother when she says. Oh, I was in the kitchen from I was 12, mm -hmm. and I found myself in a similar situation. Um, I would always help, and from then I knew that I could cook. Mm -hmm. I know you have your mother complimenting your food, makes you feel good, mm -hmm. and from then I just went on. Um, my inspiration, mm -hmm. that was my grandfather, the late James Davis. Mm -hmm. He would always be in the kitchen, I would always be right with him. Mm -hmm. So, you know, he taught me a few techniques, what I needed to know, what I wanted to know. Mm -hmm. And from then, I said, yeah, this is it. I mentioned executive chef, so do you mm -hmm. plan to go off to school to pursue a career in? Yes, absolutely. I was actually recently accepted at the University of Bahamas <gasps> for the associate's um, course in mm -hmm. culinary arts mm -hmm. and tourism studies wow. so I plan to go to UB for my first two years and then after that abroad for awesome. my bachelor's awesome yeah the final thing what I want to do is I want to be an executive chef and restaurant owner oh wow yes I have a plan to have this big restaurant an authentic Bahamian restaurant where everything I serve is Bahamian wow mm -hmm. yes awesome let's check the fish oh yeah Looking good. Ooh. <laughs> Just a few more minutes on those. Okay. We'll get those nice and brown. So tell me what are we gonna be doing next? Okay, so now we have one cup of oil from the previous frying. Mm -hmm. We're gonna pour it in there. Let that heat. Just discard that. Just gonna wait for it to heat up. So this is the roux. Yes, this mm -hmm. is the roux we're making. Okay. For this, for this pot of stew, we're using one cup of oil mm -hmm. to one cup of flour. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we have to wait a while until it heats a little bit yes, more. Yes, it should be good now. It should be good. Okay. Yes. Yeah, I'll so assist you. I'll yes. Thank you very much. <laughs> There's your flour. Thank you. So we're just gonna put this in there. And you hear that? Yes. Yes. That means it's, it's, it's Put that back. And we keep on stirring. Now it gets thick Ooh, very quick. Be, yes. yes. It gets very it's thick. Looking good. Yes, I like it. And it's so turning, it's yeah. turning. Mm -hmm. So you don't really need brown in. No, no. you don't. <laughs> Once you get this at the right color, and then don't forget we have the tomato paste to add yes, 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 yes. more color so it's going to take a while for it to it's nice and thick too. change. Just keep stirring so it doesn't stick to the bottom of the pot. Okay. You can use a whisk or you can use a regular pot spoon I if you don't have a whisk. I guess it's about that's that. A good, that's a good yes. challenge. Yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> So now we're just gonna add the fish. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Add them nice and carefully. Crisp. One. Oh man, you hear, oh. You hear that? Oh, crispy. <laughs> Music to my ears. Two. Two. All right. One, one right there. Three. <laughs> Same one. Get that in there. Oh my gosh. Look, and one. That's the, the last one. one. I'm so sorry we had to do this to you. <laughs> that is four. 
So we're just going to submerge these in there. Oh my God. And let that boil and bubble and cook that fish down. You can put this back over there. Sure. Thank you. And just cover it and watch. Ah. How long is it been now? Not long at all. Okay. Not okay. long at all. <laughs> I've been growling. <laughs> Take about 10 minutes, say. 10 minutes. Yeah. All right. All right. So now this is all ready. Let's look. Let's look. One, two, Stay three. Oh, oh yes. yeah. Look at those bubbles. Mm -hmm. Music to my ears. All right. So now we're just going to serve this. And then now it's up to the person if they want to add pepper mm -hmm. or lime or anything they want make the stew your own eh okay yes <laughs> make the stew your own let's eat there we have it stew fish made by chef t yes mm, delicious yes. now guess what we have our mommy's johnny cake we're gonna eat with that you're watching behavior tv it don't get any better than this Like crab and grits and steam jack fit Make you lick your lips and fingertips Ooh, ain't that sweet? Ain't that fine? That's fine That's Bahia and that, that is mine Ain't that sweet? Ain't that fine? That's fine That's Bahia and that, that is mine At Games and Things, Games and More and Sell All we have the largest selection of flat screen televisions in the entire Bahamas. Now, we are proud to introduce our mega special on our 4K flat screen smart televisions. Listen up, 43 inch 4K smart LED televisions, only $4.99. 50 inch 4K smart LED televisions, $5.99. 55 inch 4K LED smart televisions, $6.99. And our 65 inch 4K smart LED television going for a low, low price of only $1,399. Oh, before I forget, come in and take advantage of our 20% off on all of our small appliances. So come on down and take advantage of our huge savings. Games and Things, Marathon Road, opposite First Caribbean Bank, telephone 394-4705, Games and More, Southwest Plaza, Michael Road, telephone 361-7265, Sell All in the Marshalls Plaza, Michael Road, opposite Kazamaki Church, telephone 361-7267. Step Up Fashion providing you with your most stylish shoes and accessories for very low prices. Catch their sale on sandals as low as $10. You can find them on Facebook at Step Up Fashion 242, Instagram at Step Up underscore Fashion. You can also call, text, or WhatsApp at 466-1395 for further inquiries and deliveries. Free delivery service available. Don't miss out. Step Up Fashion, your latest fashion needs. Yeah, no stranger. Yeah, we didn't cool it up. Yeah? Yeah, man. Clean now. There's some nice shoes, man. Yeah, man. Boy, you clean now. Yeah, man. I like these shoes, you know. Boy, I get it from David Jones, boy. David Jones, eh? Yeah, man. The hot too? Yeah, the whole outfit, boy. Boy, I gotta get me one, you know. Man, go down the corner right there. Uh-huh. Yeah, man. That's a new clothing store. Yes, boy, in the corner there. All right, all right. Boy, who this dude is, man? Hey, who you is, man? David Jones, man. David Jones? Yeah, David Jones. I think he's going close, man. Can't be on the beat. Yeah, I'll just... <laughs>